Hey guys, today I'll show you how to make a simple swamp base as you have requested. What you're gonna need is uh, PVA glue, still water, uh, some sand and little rocks, a uh, cork sheet, um, of course a base and a few paints. I have chosen Caliban Green White Scar, uh, Collier Green Shade and Reichenhof Nightshade. As you can see I have already ripped uh, cork sheet to pieces. I will now apply the glue to the base. You have to remember to wash your brush afterwards or it will dry and be useless basically. The thicker the glue, the longer it will dry. I mean the thicker layer. If you want to speed up the drying process, you can always use a hair dryer. But I will just leave it for a couple of hours. And do something else in the meantime. You want to apply a little bit more glue on the edges. so the sand will stick to them. Just make sure that none of the cork base is sticking out because later we'll be gluing a sticky tape to the side of the base and you just don't want anything to be sticking out or the still water will leak. That should be enough. I basically apply glue to the sides of a cork to blend it more with a base. Yeah, that should be fine. Just leave it now for a couple of hours until it dries and we'll get back to the painting part. I'll paint it now black with Abaddon Black and my airbrush. You can do it with your brush or a primer, it doesn't really matter. Now we can move to painting, I'll be using Caliban Green. And I'll basically dry brush the whole thing.
Now I'm adding White's car to the mixture. And even more white. Just make sure it's more dry right now. I'll now wash the base and later do a little bit of dry brushing uh, of highlights again. I will apply three washes. First is Colia Green Shade. I'll apply it mostly to the brightest parts. Then Night Shade into the shadows. And violet again in the shadows and in some other places just to add a little bit more color to the mixture. And that should be enough. I will dry brush it again a little bit with white scar. Very gentle strokes. Touched me now. Very gentle strokes. Touched me now. I will now glue bits of satin grass to the base. Uh, you can get it in Games Workshop or other hobby stores. Probably most of them. We'll just apply a bit of super glue. And glue to the base. You have to be careful not to glue your finger to the base. You can use some tools to do it, but I just do it by my hand. What you're gonna need now is a sticky tape. It should be something like that. Uh, you shouldn't use the narrow one like this one because it will, when you apply still water to the base, it will wrinkle and 
the still water when it dries will be wrinkled as well so I would suggest to use something this wide just make sure it's um, evenly cut and I will just glue it to the side of the base make sure that you glue it tightly because if you're gonna get wrinkles or air bubbles uh, still water can later leak through that tape so just do it tightly When you're sure it's tight, you're ready to apply a still. I will now apply still water to the base. It should now spread evenly onto the whole base. Uh, you can leave it like that and it will stay transparent or you can do what I like to do and add a bit of wash. Uh, I usually use Collier Green Shade. Just place a few drops and mix it. You can do it on the base or earlier in some other container and then pour it on the base. I'd like to do it this way. And now we should leave it to dry for around 24 hours. So basically until tomorrow. And yeah, that's it. Eight hours have passed. I will now remove the tape. Um, I will do it because it's not completely hardened yet, but it's already hard enough not to leak and it has stick to the tape and as you can see here the excess is stick to the tape and I can easily remove it now if I would wait for 24 hours it would be too hard and I would have to later remove it with my knife. As you can see it's still sticky. But it's hard enough not to leak out of the base. Yeah, it's perfect. I'll leave it for another uh, 16 hours or so, just basically 
until tomorrow and it should be fine. The base is finished, I hope you like it. Uh, as always, all the comments and questions more than welcome. Uh, for more updates or on more miniatures, you can always go to my Facebook page. Uh, I hope you have enjoyed this tutorial and see you next time.